Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. Hope y'all are having an amazing day today. Real quick, I just want to say that I finally, finally created a Discord. The link will be down in the description below. Make sure you guys go do that if you would like to play with me, if you guys want to be in videos and streams, all that good stuff. Go join the Discord. We're going to try to make it the biggest Discord for Wizard101, so make sure you guys go do that. Today, we are back in Mushu, my favorite Arc 1 world by far. We're going to be taking a look at two of the Forgotten Homes in Mushu. I made a last video in Dragon's Fire of the two houses and you guys really really love that video so I hope you guys do love this video as well and if you want to see another one drop a like subscribe do all the fun stuff 85% of you guys are not subscribed so make sure you guys go do that here we are came let's see what you got bro so the tranquil cottage the cheapest house of the two 15,000 gold is how much it would cost you if you guys end up like in this house so I'm by no means no house expert I'm just giving my overall opinion so don't roast me down in the comments if I'm pooping on a house that you like. I'm just giving my honest opinion. But honestly, this is by far a way better house than any of the houses in the last video. I love the colors. It really reminds me of Mushu. The colors are very bright and vibrant. But this house, look, you have a little dojo down here. This is kind of where you would think like a PvP ring would go. But like I said in my last video, these homes were made before PvP rings being in homes was even a thing. But this would definitely be a cool little area to put a pvp ring so it's pretty cool that this house sits on a little pond if you add some mushu themes this would honestly make the house but uh let's go inside really quick see how much room we're working with i'm not really expecting it to be that much it's kind of just a little square dojo there's like a room down here you could do like yoga meditate whatever you gotta do but up here it looks like it's just one singular room which is kind of disappointing it's kind of small to be honest i would expect there to be at least one or two rooms but it's a very cool vibe like i said you add another mushu shoe theme in here then it would definitely get the nostalgia going but let's go ahead take a look at the next house i know this house is gonna absolutely be insane boom but here we are the imperial palace and our friend morella what is up there's space all to the right over here you could you know add some plants or whatever you want and there's cool little stones you can walk across and you can walk under the main bridge of the house it's really cool seeing the water flow throughout the house it's a very nice addition so this is by far one of my favorite houses in the entire game it's one of the best looking in my opinion especially for the time that it was released the other homes in the game really at the time weren't up to par with this house so once you walk in the front door you were greeted with this giant opening you could really do a lot of stuff with this I'm not really a house decorator so I'm not the one to go to but you could definitely make use of all this space there's a nice big room right in here you could probably turn it into a living room or whatever you want shout out to all the home decorators I do not have the patience at all to even mess with the house I usually end up selling all of my furniture and stuff to clear up bag space but if you guys are into home decorating you know this could definitely be a cool house especially it's not really that popular a ton of people you know always have the same homes and it's cool to see different homes unpopular homes decorated every once in a while i cannot tell you the last time i was actually in one of these homes decorated like it has been so long but there's just a ton of space in here it's identical on the other side so if symmetry is a big thing for you home decorators then this is a really cool house to have but other than that, you come out here and then you just have some more extra space if you want to add some plants or anything like that. It's a really awesome home. Definitely the better of the two. So that's pretty much going to be it for this house. I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you want to see another one, like I said, drop a like, subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand new. Make sure to go ahead, join the Discord down below. You guys have to do that. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll catch you all in the next video. Peace.